This is KSN News 3 at 10. A 39-year-old woman, mayor-elect of the best city in America. The air capital under new leadership in the new year. Political newcomer Lily Wu upsets incumbent Brandon Whipple to become Wichita mayor. The final unofficial result just came into our newsroom within the last hour. Good evening, I'm Julia Thatcher. And I'm Jeff Hearn in the Wichita mayoral race, one of nearly 400 we're keeping track of in the KSN viewing area. You can see the results scrolling at the bottom of your screen, but you can see the full breakdown on KSN.com. KSN is here for you with team coverage all day. Our reporters are covering some of the biggest races from mayor to city council and school board, along with other issues up for a vote. Let's uh, begin tonight with uh, Craig Andrus, live at Lily Wu's campaign watch party. Craig, you're standing by with the uh, mayor-elect. I am. She's just started giving some interviews. Uh, let's have a listen in, and I'll also ask her a question. In our community, because our officers are now 100 officers down in terms of a shortage in the workforce, so we really need to work on that. And our officers need the respect and resources necessary to keep our community safe. And I want all Wichitans to also be part of the solution in helping us to reduce crime in Wichita. All right, Lily Wu, the next mayor of Wichita. Thank you so much. We're going to see you back tomorrow. And Lily, I did want to ask you, since we're live here, you thanked your family, first of all, and secondly, you wanted to thank the voters. But the third thing you said was interesting to me, you wanted to work very closely with the city commissioners. That's right. I'm really excited about working with six other council members who all care about Wichita. And I want to be that consensus builder and bridge builder that gets an agenda forward that really works for all of Wichita. I believe that every city council member wants to work on public safety, wants to work on providing economic opportunities for all, and wants to make sure that citizens know what local government is doing so we need to restore trust in city hall now you thanked everybody who worked on your campaign what do you attribute the win to i am just really grateful that people believed in a vision that truly united everyone in our community towards the basics of local government but also an excitement that is non-partisan and i kept it very much to the spirit of what it's supposed to be because we're all in the same team. We're all Wichitans and I need all Wichitans to be part of the solutions moving forward. We have a lot of challenges moving ahead. Homelessness, we have a mental health crisis and we have a police officer shortage in our community which is a workforce problem and we need to make sure that we have a community that not only uh, respects but also provides the resources for our officers to be part of our community towards helping solve and reduce crime in Wichita. Lily Wu, our next mayor, thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate it. Okay, so this is a Lily Wu watch party, our next mayor of Wichita. So let's pitch it over to Sammy Samantha Boring. Hey, Craig, we are here at Merrill's place off of Seneca. This is where Mayor Brandon Whipple had his watch party. Pretty much everyone has left at this point. Just before 830 tonight, Mayor Brandon Whipple announced to the crowd that he and his family were going home. He thanked his supporters that were here for their work on the campaign this last year. Vice Mayor Mike Hoheisel, County Commissioner Sarah Lopez and City Councilwoman Maggie Ballard all in attendance tonight as Mayor Whipple made a short speech before leaving. Yeah, it doesn't look great right now, uh, but I appreciate it's not due to uh, folks not working hard. So uh, thank you all, uh, and I'm going to take these kids back to bed. Mayor Whipple made no mention of his opponent, Lily Wu, tonight. He just said he was not giving up, just waiting to see what happens as the votes come in. Jeff Julia, back to you.